Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today, I'm going to talk to you guys about what type of camera equipment I use and some of the gear and the rigging and all that kind of stuff. So, stay with me and here we go. So, I'm going to go ahead and walk you through some of my equipment that I have. And it's very, very cool stuff, you know. Uh, at least I, I think it is. All right, so the first thing I like to show y'all is this really cool nifty little SD card holder that I made. I was looking for, you know, a way of holding SD cards and I wasn't sure since I have so many of them. Um, I didn't know, so I just made something really quick. I have them organized, 32s are over here. Uh, anything that's like a 16 or lower than a 32 goes there and I got 32s there and then 64s and then same thing over here and uh, one of the cool things that I got just in the mail is this Hero 4 now we are currently using the Hero 3 Plus right now to film you guys see Hero 3 Plus I love this camera it works great and I love that camera too That camera too, especially the ring. Oh, well I might as well show you guys this right here. This right here is my most important rigging that I am using. Um, what I do is I hook it up to the monitor so that way I can adjust it. And then I have the light ring and everything else I needed. Microphones, I hooked up some power down there. I built my own tripod and it works great. I put the amp there. And of course you guys already know about the microphones there's one there and there's one there and then we have one right here talking but let's continue with the tour speaking of microphones check this little thing out this right here is for my GoPro um, I haven't used it yet I just got it in so I'm really tempted to to use it and then I showed you all the hero 4 and then this right here is my um, this is a cheaper version of a GoPro this is I use this one when I'm doing things that I don't want my other ones to get destroyed and then of course with GoPros you need batteries um, I got a dual charger here and a battery bank there and then we got some all-weather boxes now I have a light that attaches here but I haven't got it in the mail yet um, that's an amp this right here these are um, adapters uh, they're made of metal and they actually unscrew from each other every single one of them unscrews like This see how it unscrews and then that one right there will unscrew from that and then what you do is you use it to find your um, Your lens whatever that way if the lens that you have doesn't fit your camera You can use one of these adapters and as you see it goes all the way up to a to a fairly big size and these are great they're real cheap they're only like 10 bucks to have um, but I got a couple different sets um, let's see here GoPro oh this is pretty cool this right here let me show you all this so this little neat thing right here see the bottom of the camera what it does is it screws into the bottom like that so that way you can hold the camera isn't that pretty cool guys see this thing right that pretty cool guys see this thing right here just kind of threads into the bottom of uh, well basically any camera that you got but, yeah, it allows you to hold the camera like that but anyway that's what that does so moving on um, I have some lenses here this is my 72 millimeter wide angle lens and then it has a lens hood on it this is a 37 millimeter lens that I use uh, for like close-ups and stuff and then I have a couple of different types of tripods uh, this one right here is my favorite because it it it's a tripod and it doubles as a hand grip so you know pistol grip same as this right here and then I got a smaller one and then a cheap one that right there was my first one and then I got this one right here which is one that I take when I go places and do stuff so it, it can get beat up from time to time 
This right here is our original camera. This is the R2-D2. Uh, I absolutely love this camera. I've probably shot over 100, 100 plus YouTube videos on this camera alone. So it's one of my favorite. And then it's rocking a shotgun mic on top. Moving on. <clears throat> this right here is my Coolplex. Uh, I really like this camera because it takes phenomenal photos I mean it just it takes really good photos and it's what I use for my eBay store and stuff and some other places but it's been a good camera to me and I really like it and that's the little case that it comes with and then this right here is the camera that replaced that one this camera I love it has a little screen right there as you can see um, it takes phenomenal photos as well I mean better better than the other one um, the only thing I would have to say about it is it doesn't do very well when it comes to video but it takes phenomenal photos that's that's the main reason why I got it is because it takes great photos and now I use this one right here for my thumbnails and for uh, you know ads and stuff like that if I'm trying to sell something this is what I'll use and then let's see here moving on this is a camera bag for it and then this is my other camera let's see here I'll open this one up for you and show it to you oh nope that ain't it How's this? wait a minute it's been a while since I've opened it all right so I'm gonna show you guys this camera right here it just unzips like that and then you just reach in and pull it out. This is an HDD Panasonic. Uh, it has a really great zoom on it. Sometimes I will take this to like car shows or other events. It does a good job, you know, as far as HD cameras go. But yeah, I really like this one. It, it does a great job. I don't really use it too much ever since Ever since I got my GoPros, I really don't use it too much because I, I, I really don't have a need to it. The GoPros are smaller um, and they actually have better video quality, you know. So, so that right there was just kind of a quick showing of some of the things that I have, my lenses and then some of the different cameras that I use. And then this is the camera back, like when I'm going out to do a shoot or to do something um, you know I'll I'll use this I'll put my cameras in here the these uh, compartments right here they come out and you can kind of make individual compartments any way you like this right here was my first camera bag I do have another camera bag but I'm not exactly sure where it is I did something with it not sure but yeah so that was basically my whole camera setup. What do you guys think? Did y'all like some of the stuff that I showed you? Did you not expect me to have that much stuff? Um, do you think something like this is overkill for someone like me? Um, you know, I'm really liking this setup. I had to completely change it from how the picture looks and how I put it together on, on the, uh, the last video that I did. But yeah, so anyway, that right there takes care of takes care of all of my camera stuff, everything that I wanted to show you guys. So yeah, thank you so much guys for watching. Um, I appreciate y'all. Make sure to hit that like. If you didn't like it, well, hit the like anyway. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Support us on Patreon. Join our group on Facebook. We are on four or five different platforms now, guys. We're on Facebook. We're on Tumblr, Bit2, which is pretty cool. You get paid um, in Bitcoin for people watching your videos on their platform, which is really cool. And now we're on Patreon. So we're, we're getting big, and I want to bring you guys along with me. So tell your friends. We're going to do a giveaway real soon, guys. Make sure to check it out. And thank you. Thank you so much for watching. As always, you guys be cool. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.